Okay, I'm going to read all the really mean comments that these so-called great people made. Someone take this camera away, please. You look like a butthole. Hurry the fuck up and choke on a sandwich. You repugnant whale of a cunt. I'm reading through them. A stupid blonde strikes again. Unfortunately, I'm not blonde no more, and I'm not truly a blonde. So, but in the video, I kind of do have somewhat blonde hair. Somewhat. Alright, comment was removed. One comment was flagged. Unfortunately, I did not get to see those. Nor do I understand how to remove any comments. So, What the hell is wrong with your hair? Did you forget to cut one side? No. Unfortunately... You don't see this kind of hairstyle very often, but I like it. So if you don't, go F yourself. Both are my sides, and my back is cut low. And I have the top part high. Why? Because I am a dyke. That's how I like my hair. Uh, yeah, so that's about it for that one. I got a lot. I got some nice ones. Laughing my ass off. This chick is too ugly. G T F O. Oh, I'm sorry. Get the fuck off the internet with that shit. Note how no one is taking your ass seriously. You're disgusting next time you want to make a point across. Maybe fix the thing you have on your head. I think it's hair. And clean that filthy mouth of yours. You look like you probably smell like spoiled milk. First of all, I'm a very clean person. My house is not messy. I am a very clean person, like hygiene wise as well. Um, the way my hair is, unfortunately, it likes to fall on this side, no matter what I do, so, yeah, I don't know, but there's a lot of mean people on here, <laughs> fat ass motherfucker dick vagina liquor. I don't know, they spelled a lot of that wrong. So, <laughs> and by the way, I didn't curse that much in the video. I think the only curse word I said was fuck because it was three o'clock in the morning and I seen it and I was, I was really upset. Like, how can you call a baby a butthole? I didn't do anything to you nor anybody else. Oh, um, here's another one. Damn, I felt, no, that's not it. <laughs> ah. Hold on. You're a stupid, retarded piece of dumb shit. That's nice. Really don't know what to say to that one. Um, it's a stupid comment.
Hmm. Okay. Sort your life out, you little whore. No one cares about your opinion. Just because you get bullied in school doesn't mean you need to flag your YouTube with these pointless videos. Shut the fuck up. You're a butthole. Why would a woman say baby passed away? She's sick. The baby did pass away. Died with its mom. And I don't know. She posted as a memory. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> We're the jerks. Look at yourself. So sad in your mommy's basement. <laughs> That woman said her child died taking a bath. How cruel is it to say that of one's child? First of all, wasn't her child. Or his child. We don't know if it's a guy or a girl, but... Um, I'm trying to find the stupid comment. <laughs> Anywho, the baby didn't die in the bathtub. And for whatever reason, um, right, I'm trying to find the damn thing. First of all, we're not all jerks, just the ones that post mean comments. And I never had a mom that I know of. Unfortunately, yes, people come from somewhere. So unfortunately, I did have a mom. I just never met her. And I wouldn't dream of meeting her. Um, yeah. And I own my own house. It's paid for. I'm like... A lot of these mean people, they probably live with their mom or whatever in their basement, but I don't. Here's new one. Here's some new ones that um that are interesting. Ha ha ha. You are white. You are fat. You are white trash. You are not black. You do not look good with that fucking nasty looking hair. Your piercings are retarded. And your camera is low quality shit just like you. That is all. Yes, I'm white. I love the fact that I'm white, but I'm not just white. I'm Indian. Irish, French, German, and I do, unfortunately, do have a little bit of black in me, and no, not just because my husband's black, not that kind of black in me, but <laughs> it's kind of funny, <laughs> but anyway, uh, yeah, I posted another one. Ha ha ha, I am six foot one, 250 pounds. And could probably bench your fat ass. Ha ha ha. I would love to see you try and act tough to me in real life. I would knock you on your fight, fat white trash ass. Ha ha ha. Cute how, y how your nig you nigger loving white trash wigger think you are hard. Remember you're a female. You cannot take a man on. Little cunt. Okay, why, I want to know why men think just because other women or we are women and that we do have, you know, a different private part <laughs> that we can't take on a man. Let me tell you something, just because I'm chunky, I have more muscle, I don't look my weight I, I actually do have more muscle than actual 
weight. I can bench press 255 pounds. My husband is 280, 280 between 285. He's somewhere between there. He always fluctuates. But anyways, he's all muscle. And I can pick his ass up literally on top of my shoulders and just walk him around. And I do it for fun to pick at him. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I've knocked, I've actually literally knocked his ass down a couple times. We were just playing, though. It was nothing serious. I had told him to wrestle me, and he did, and I kind of took him down really hard. But it was, it was an accident. I didn't mean to, you know, I didn't mean to do it, like, in a meanful way. I meant to do it in a playful way, but it didn't turn out in a playful way, and he got mad at me, and he got kind of took back a little bit with a little bit more muscle, and I went for full force, which was kind of funny. But anyways, those are all my mean comments. And unfortunately, I only have mean comments on one of my videos and not all 50 or 51 or something. I don't know how many videos I have. But um, yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say. I guess just an update on all the mean people who call me a loser and whatever and whatever just remember this whatever you say on the internet you could be lying nobody knows that but you but if you do talk shit online it's probably because you're going through it and it probably makes you feel better or gives you a bigger ego to say it to somebody else. Yeah, I know a lot of people like that. Especially men. They think they have this huge ego because they can talk shit to somebody. But when it comes the other way around and the person's talking shit to them, all of a sudden, they have nothing to say. Yeah. Just know this. If you're going to talk shit about somebody, make sure you know them or somewhat know them before you say something stupid and make yourself look retarded. Um, yeah, that's pretty much all I can say.